Hey guys, welcome back to another Tech Guru video. Today we're in iOS 7 and I'm going to be showing you some iOS 7 battery saving tips. So with iOS 7, regardless of what version you have of it, it does tend to run the battery down a little quicker than iOS 6 does and if you find your iOS 7 device running low on battery all the time, these few tips are going to be able to help you try to make sure that your device doesn't lose battery as quickly as it is now. Now the first thing you want to do obviously is make sure that you are up to date on all of the firmware. Obviously Apple uh, puts these things out for a reason and there are probably fixes in each firmware update that will indeed fix your battery life. Now the first thing that I am going to be showing you is going to be under settings. So if you don't know where that is, it's the little gear icon here. Click on settings and then once you are there, go to mail, contacts, and calendars, which is highlighted blue right here. Once you are there, you will see an option that says fetch new data. It is right here highlighted in darker gray. And then once you are there, you will see up at the top, the push is turned on. Now this, what it does, it's trying to pull mail or contacts or calendar updates, whatever it may be from the server that you've provided it with at all times. This can really run your battery down. Now if you need this, obviously for business purposes you cannot do this, but if you don't, go ahead and slide that over to the left there where it's no longer green and this will help you out tremendously. The next thing that you're going to want to do is go under general here and then you're going to see something that says accessibility which is highlighted right here in dark gray. Click on that and then you're going to see a few options here. The one that you're going to want to look for is the reduce motion option which is right here. Now you may be wondering what is reduced motion? Now with iOS 7, Apple released a new 3D look whenever you're looking at your iOS 7 device. Some of you may not even know it's there, but if you go ahead and slide this over to the right, you're not going to get that cool looking you know, angle or 3D look when you open your device, but this will save you dramatically in battery life. When it's trying to do this effect, it will affect your battery life on your device. Now, the last tip that I'm going to show you is going to be right here under privacy, which is highlighted in blue now. If you go to privacy and then you go up top to the location services, which is now highlighted in gray, just like so, you will see a few options here. Now, obviously, some of these you're going to need to leave on for purposes that you may have personally but for me I can go and go ahead and swap a few of these off here and that will indeed improve my battery life now that is a few tips to help your battery life the last bonus tip that I'm going to give you is this make sure that all of your background applications like you see here I have a ton of them that are open in the background in order to get to those background applications and close those double click the home button and you will then see all of the open applications that are running in the background on your iOS 7 device and in order to close those all you need to do is just click on one of those with your finger kind of hover over it and then just swipe up just like I'm doing there swipe up with your finger and that will remove all of these applications that are running in the background so this is gonna close all of those running applications on your iOS 7 device I hope this tip video helped you out if you're running low on battery life or your iOS device is running hot if it did go ahead and like this video down below subscribe to my channel for more great content like this and guys I will see you next time Thank <laughs> you.